So today in the instant pot, we are going to do a blade pot roast. So what you want to do is you're going to want to hit saute. Once that becomes hot, you're going to put some oil in and you're going to sear your roast on all sides. Apparently I need to buy oil. But there you go, get some oil in there. And now <clears throat> you're going to take your roast and you're going to sear it on each side. You don't want to leave it too long again, you just want to sear it on each side here. There's that oil in there. And there you go, your roast is done. I'm just kidding. Though I could eat it like this, I'd be fine with that. Now you're going to take a cup of chicken stock, or I'm actually going to be using um, a cup of the broth from the, the full soup that I made uh, in a previous video, just the other day actually. Um, basically it's chicken broth uh, with some flavoring. And you're going to deglaze the, the Instant Pot with that. Okay, so you're going to stop this. You are going to put the lid on. Put the lid on. Turn it over. Make sure it's on seal. You are going to hit annual. And you are going to go all the way up to 40, 40 to 45 minutes, depending on uh, the size. I mean, 40 to 5 to 50 minutes. Sorry, I was thinking something else. So we'll go 45 minutes, and uh, yeah, so. This will probably take about 15 minutes to get up, build up the pressure in it before the timer will actually start. Um, so it will be roughly an hour uh, wait time now. Now, in 45 minutes, you're gonna make sure you have ready uh, your peeled and cut carrots, your cut up potatoes, um, because once this thing goes off, you're going to quick release it, you're going to open it up, you're going to drop in your potatoes, you're going to drop in your carrots, and then you're going to pressure cook it for another 10 minutes. you got 37 minutes to go while you're waiting. you I've got my carrots here. You can peel, chop them up. You need your uh, one cup measuring cup for your wine. And of course, while you're doing that, you might as well have a glass of wine. Okay, so it's done. You want to hit the instant release. That takes a little bit to go. Yeah, so you're going to throw in your cut cut up carrots, cut up uh, the sweet potato in there instead of regular potatoes. You got to throw that in quickly. You got to throw the lid right back on. You're going to set it to pressure cooking. You're going to go for another 10 minutes on pressure cooking. So now that it's done, you're going to crack it open. Wow, look at that, eh? Now what you're going to do is, whoops, shoot. You're going to There we go. We're going to throw all those in there. Place them all around nicely. All right now, put your lid back on. Put your lid back on. Back to seal. You're going to manu manual. You're going to go down to 10 minutes. There you go. Now wait. 10 minutes comes, we're going to, again, quickly release that, open it up, we're going to scoop everything out of there, and then we're going to make our sauce for the roast. Okay, so your 10 minutes is over, you're going to turn around, you're going to, whoop, release that. Now once that's done, you're going to crack that open, you're going to take your roast out, you're also going to scoop all your potatoes and carrots out, put them into a separate bowl. Now while that's releasing, you want to make sure you get your plate ready for your roast, you get a bowl ready for your vegetables for the time being, and you also want to make sure you have a pot with this ready, a bowl, anything you want, because you're going to pour that in afterwards to strain all the, the stuff out of the juice uh, to make your sauce. Okay, so while it's done, 
There we go, it's done. Open it. So now, there you go. Now well, let's get everything out. So you're going to pour all the liquid in there after you've got everything out. Strain everything away that you don't need. Let's just toss that over there. There we go. Now you're going to put your juice. And you're going to pour back in there. Okay, so like you said, you got your roast here, which is <laughs> fall apart type roast now. You got your um, carrots and sweet potato there. Now you're gonna add, you're gonna turn around, you're gonna hit saute. So you're gonna saute this, right? You're gonna let this go. You're gonna add your butter. I'm going to leave the lid off for now, and you're also going to add your cup of red wine. Now what you're going to want to do is you want to reduce this sauce. You want to let it go for a little while, and you want to reduce it by about half of what it is right now. Meanwhile, we've cut up our roast. We've put the carrots and the potato around it. The sweet potato doesn't hold together as well as a regular potato, I find. It does go a little mush, but it's still tasty as hell. And then here we are. We are reducing this still. And this might take a little bit because you want this to reduce, like I said, by half. You get a little thicker. And we'll go with there. So we reduced it by half. Then you're going to scoop it. Just drizzle over your meat. You know what? Throw some of your carrots while you're at it. Just just because. There we go. And voila. Pot roast with carrots and sweet potato all done in one pot. But you, you don't even need an oven anymore. You know, a stove, an oven, you don't need it. You've got an Instant Pot. And voila. Cheers.